<laughs> hey guys, Crazy96 here, coming at you with MHC underscore 2017 underscore DEC, because we like shortening things now. Uh, <laughs> this month's challenge is the Mansion Challenge, where my dearly departed uncle, who is dearly departed, uh, which is unfortunate for him, but fortunate for me, he left me the deed to his mansion, and we're going to go claim it. So, uh, let's go, I guess. I think that's all we need to know. See if this world will load. Perfect. Okay. Let's start by grabbing some mushrooms. Why are we lagging? <laughs> That's not good. I, that's really not good. Okay, it seems to be smoothing out. Start for grabbing these, because it'll be a decent source of food, hopefully. For a little while, anyways. Plus, the mansion probably is going to have some dark spots. Um... For which I am able to do the things and the stuff. So, one of the things I'm going to want to do in this series, if I even make it into it more than a day or two, because uh, as we know, day three does not exist. Um, let's get the F3 menu up as well, because we got coordinates we got to go to negative 623, 447. I'm never coming back to this area. I uh, gotta find the mansion. But anyways, it's one of the things I want to experiment with. I don't know if there's an official answer uh, from Mike Deering on this. But Totem of Undying. Cow, what are you doing, cow? You're making my life more difficult is what you're doing. You're gonna push me around. Don't push me around, cow. It's not very nice. Could have at least told me to move... Alright, crappy jokes aside, Totem of Undying. It's almost like a second life in the MHC. Alright, so we want to head towards negative 600 and then 400? So I guess this way. Um, we're going to grab that tree though so I can make some bowls. Now we're just going to get going. Okay. Oh, shit. <laughs> Whoopsie. <laughs> so. Memory serves me, and it doesn't. I don't remember how to get the totem of undying. I don't remember which boss you have to kill. So that should be interesting, at least. Because there is a boss in the mansion that I believe is what you have to kill in order to get the Totem of Undying. And I know you don't need a crafting bench to make mushroom stew. But we're going to just do it there because I was there. Need to make bowls though. question is, should I just grab a bunch of mushrooms for right now? Well, shoot, why did I do that again? Why am I lagging too? I shouldn't be. I might go back to a setup with a separate recording PC and gaming PC. Because I could do that with the monitor setup I have. And I could run something like Synergy. Or, which is a, basically a software KVM. Which would allow me to integrate the monitor for the entirely separate machine into my monitor displays if it's just another screen and use the same keyboard and mouse, which is neat. It's a cool concept. I know back in the day, when I was originally trying Synergy, but they might have fixed it. Um, 
had issues in Counter-Strike where it wouldn't allow the game to capture the cursor. So that's not cool, but... Do Rose just hurt you? I feel like that's a missed opportunity. How do I scale that? I guess that's how I scale it. Yeah. Shoot. I guess I scale it with my parkour skills. That I don't have. Okay. I want to get to negative 623. Whoops. Positive 427. Okay. We're moving in the right direction. Had a little fun in the treetops there. It's dangerous to have fun in the treetops sometimes, though. I might fall. Get hurt. Have a lawsuit. <laughs> Sue the owner of the trees. That's the culture we're in, right? Okay. You will get to uh, boringly watch me run here for a while. Okay. Sheepies. Okay. Chunk error. There we go. I didn't see anything cool with it though. Okay. Where was we? Oh, we're getting there. That looked safe. How is everybody doing on this wonderful, wonderful Monday, I guess, right? Monday, December the 4th, something like that. I think so. I think it's the 4th, because Friday was the 1st. I'm not even sure anymore. I'm going to grab some more mushrooms, though, because I know I have more browns than reds right now. So I will alleviate that problem. Oh, shoot. And then I'll have more reds than browns, and that'll be its own separate issue. Um, whoop. Lost my train of thought. So this was a fun weekend for me because uh, right now it's Sunday as I'm recording. So it's December 3rd. And I actually had a weekend for once because I recently left my job to have me working overnights on the back half of the week. Which was obnoxious and it sucked. Um, I left that and I went back to a Monday to Friday job at a different company. And... It's a much more fun position, and I get weekends again, so I got to actually go to a robotics competition this weekend, which I haven't been able to do in a long time. Um, and I find those to be a lot of fun. Not that I compete anymore, but I just go to help out. Alright, we gotta be getting close at this point. Negative 623, so we're within 60 blocks that way. What's that spider doing here? They didn't attack you during the day. There it is. Guess my uncle was a rich dude.
your skeletons. A lot of sheep too. I thought of all the things that I could do with my life, but this is probably one of the things that I should hold tight. But then and again I go back to a time when life was simpler. But music makes me bounce off the walls like a fucking ticker. My question is where is the front door? Maybe the coordinates correspond to the front door, because this is negative 623, and 447 is that way, so I'm probably on the wrong side. But I heard a thing. Come on! You jump, you piece of crap game. I feel like it's running at 60 FPS. It is, but it doesn't feel like it. There's the front door. Hello? Anybody out there? Is anybody watching me? Do you still believe? Okay, that's enough cheesy song title, song, sing song, whatever, words, <laughs> sing. Um, let's really quickly, oh wait, I already have the, mm, not very good at crafting. Let's at least do this, because it's faster than my fist. I'm not in a very good spot right now. Let's do that, let's do that, let's do that. Let's dig ourselves a little hole in the ground. Where's our torch? Okay. Night one base, all in the ground outside of mansion. Now we can expand it a little bit. Just need to get in here first. Okay. At least this way we can't get ransacked by mobs right off the bat. That's a good thing. As this month's challenge, there's going to be a lot of death by mobs, I have a feeling. Shoot. Let's just do that. Stone Age! thing to do a thing um, while that thing is doing its thing we're gonna grab more things which is extremely highly descriptive so we're gonna want to do torches so we're gonna want sticks Use that charcoal to make more charcoal to make torches. Okay. Oh, man. My knuckles are cramping. I haven't played a PC game in so long that I'm not used to just, like, having my hand on a keyboard like that. 
It's it's been a little while. It's been a hot minute. Oh, let me while it's doing that, let me fix this because that looks like garbage. That's better, I think. That's a lot better, I think. It's just that big box logo looks out of place. That's unfortunate. It'd be really cool if torches in the offhand of vanilla Minecraft would emit light. I wish they would. That'd be nice. I forget which mod pack it was that they did that in. It was Terraformacraft, which Tim and I did in a series that failed miserably. Um, yeah, <laughs> it failed miserably. That's the only way to put it. We rage quit at that series very, very much so. Very hard, we rage quit. Yes. I don't know why I went so aggressive on the charcoal torches. Probably should have kept some wood for reasons, but... I chose against it, because I'm silly. Look at that iron. Ironing. Hmm, cool. Oh wait, I shouldn't have used all the charcoal or torches. Now I can't smelt that iron until I find coal. Eh, crap. I'm not very smart. It's okay though, we don't all have to be smart. The world does need some stupid people, so, like, there's that. And you can always find a bigger idiot. That's always an option. Anytime you try to make something idiot-proof, someone will find you a bigger idiot. It's just kind of like a rule of life. It's impossible to make anything idiot-proof. That's, uh, that's your philosophy lesson of the day. Try to make it idiot-proof, I will find you a bigger idiot. That was a, that's a good one that my boss used to say. New recipe is unlocked. Must have got a new stone or something. I think that's coal beneath my feet. Yes, it is. Hopefully a big vein. And we're still day zero, so we're still in good shape. We're still where we should be. Okay. That's good. We can get that iron going soon. That's a lot of coal. New recipe's unlocked. Forgot they did that now. <sighs> Shoot. <sighs> I am tired today. Still haven't entirely caught up on sleep from doing overnights. I'm still reasonably tired most of the time at this point. We're getting close. We're coming up on 19 minutes of recording, which probably means about 18 minutes of the episode. Okay. Let's think here. How far down did I get? Because we're at 64. Yeah, I'm not even close to diamond level, so we're not going to get diamonds here. So I can just go finish out with a stone and wood pick, I guess, for now. Not even close to diamond level. Kind of biome we're in too. Roofed forest. I guess roofed forest because it's an F. <laughs> yeah, why am I so tired? I don't understand. I'm probably sleep deprived, so I'm catching up on that. I guess more iron, iron in. Ooh, new recipes unlocked. Again, I, I don't understand why they went with that idea. If I get a new material, of course it's unlocking something new. Like, I would be able to do it. So I don't understand why it tells you 
that you've unlocked a recipe. There must be a way to disable that. Oh man, that's slow. I forgot how bad wooden pickaxes were. It's wooden everything, really. All the wooden tools kind of suck. Grab this coal with it, though. And I suspect that's about how the day will finish off, is gathering coal. Ah, shoot. close here. <laughs> Come on. You can do it. Let's see if we can get this whole vein before it switches. Oh, more vein. Mm, it expands. Goes on forever. Oh, that's day one. Okay, shoot. Let me grab those at least. Now we'll exit to the title. Oh, that's an interesting start text right there. I can't read that. <laughs> okay. Um. Yeah, that was uh, episode one. Day zero. And uh, we made it through at least. No one dies on day zero, though. That's the rule. So, it's really, it's really the next episode that is the uh, moment of truth, if we can manage to get through that, or if we die again, per the usual. So, uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, you know the drill. Like the video if you liked it. Dislike it if you didn't like it. Comment down below telling me um, how terrible I am and how I'm never going to make it through the next day of this challenge. <laughs> uh, head on over to... BigBoxOfGamers.com, head on over to GregC96.com, do all the things and all the stuffs that I always tell you to do, and we shall see you guys in the next one. Peace.